All right, here we go. Back to Boulder's Gate. Another collector box. Hope everyone's doing well on this Monday. We're just uh, busy here, busy Monday, shipping out items. Uh, I'm gonna throw on some gloves here. I'm feeling a dragon. Feeling a borderless foil ancient copper dragon today. So we're gonna get these gloves on. If we're gonna grade any of the borderless foil dragons. Oh yeah. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it today. We've opened a lot of these boxes and had very few. Very few. I wonder if anyone knows the pull rate. I'd love to know for these borderless foil dragons. Um, best part of the day right here, cracking packs. I'm getting orders out. Las Vegas cards and collectibles on eBay. For any of you who need any cards, everything we pull here will be listed. Um, soon we'll be starting Dominaria. We're not there yet. We're still on Boulder's Gate. I love this set. I think it's a great set. I think it's really underrated. And uh, here we go, right into it. Flaming Fist. First rare, the Invoker Adept. Spectacular Showdown, Alter. The Decadent, Carlotch, this one's nice. And, oh, a Borderless Foil. Battle Angels of Tyre. Pulled one of these yesterday, and there were some comments about the background not being as great in the borderless foil version. And uh, it's actually, it's true. It's a little bit, it's, it's kind of faded. Uh, up close in person, you can definitely see the wings and everything, especially at the right shine of the card, if you hit the right light. But yeah, I can tell on camera. It doesn't look as good on camera as in person, but still, it is faded. It's definitely true. This is a nice card though, $20 pull, $18. We'll say, we'll say 20. Um, I mean, these boxes I think are cheap. There's a ton of good uncommons, ton of good commons, uh, lots of rares that sell. I think these Boulder's Gate collector boxes and set boxes are cheap. Fire Diamond Foil. Um, Cloak of the Bat. Oh, there's a nice one. That card sells. A Foil Tasha the Witch Queen. Nice card. Stick Together. Wand of Wonder. Ragadraga. Minsk and Boo. Borderless. Uh, it's been fluctuating a lot between $25, $30. Uh, I'm going to say $30 for right now. Uh, Gale's Redirection. Okay, so the Tasha is probably, let's say, we'll go make sure we'll say cheap. We'll go $5 on the Tasha. We'll go, uh, I think this card's $30. We'll look it up, though. Uh, Tasha the Witch Queen. Foil. I'm gonna, you know what I'm gonna do today? I'm gonna put the prices on the screen here. Uh, I wasn't anticipating it. Some people had asked in the comments for a video where we show the prices. Uh, I think that's a good idea. So for this video, all the best cards, we'll tally the prices. Nice foil swift foot boots. Foil Island. Etched Master Chef. Okay, this card's been selling like crazy. The Shadow Heart Dark Justicar. Harper Recruiter. Wizards of Thay. The Lord of Bones. We sold some of these. Not a bunch. Jan Jansen and the Harvester with a Knight token. All right. Nothing too great to speak of in that pack. Come on, where are these dragons? Where are these dragons? I'm not gonna stop till we pull the ancient copper. Foil Basilisk Gate, even these are worth a bit. Bone Burnished Heart. Oh, 
Ooh, a foil archivist. Beautiful card here. Journey to the Lost City, Under Mountain, Shameless Charlatan, The Decadent, and there's no foil, huh? No showcase foil, no extended foil in this pack. But there were uh, one, two, three, four, five rares. Interesting. Interesting pack there. All right, let's sleeve up the Archivist. Beauty right here. Okay, next pack. Come on. Come on, Ancient Copper. I just think these are an absolute steal right now. I really like the set, plus just the pure value. From a pure value perspective, I think these are undervalued. Etched. Windshaper. Ooh, the Dread Wolf Herald. Spire Garden. That's a nice card right here. Let's see, what is it? I'm not sure what the wolf herald is worth might have to we'll have to look that one up basilisk collar extended foil this card's really cheap it used to be this card used to be expensive but uh this card's really cool really pretty i love the art on this one sweet this is not a bad box at all some nice pulls we still have uh, quite a few packs and some really big hitting cards we could potentially hit here. Come on. I think these and the set boxes, since there's so many good list cards, are just a really good deal. Manor Gate, all these gates, there's a lot of gate decks being built. All these gates are worth something. Alter, Loot Dispute, Wrathful Red Dragon. That's a nice little rare here. A couple dollars on the Wrathful Red. Nero, Wild Mage. Ragadraga again, and an Alter. All right. Nothing crazy in these uh, extended foil slots yet. The Battle Angels was nice. Here we go. Here we go. Two-handed axe. That card's nice. Cells. Playable. Here we go. The Thirst. The Baldric Earthquake Dragon. That card's cool. The Waterdeep Prodigy. Ah. The Bestower and the Under Mountain Adventurer. Dragon Token's really cool. I like this one a lot. All right, we got five packs left. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Just feeling a dragon today. Maybe I'm wrong. Just really feeling it. Ooh, another Battle Angels of Tyre foil. Nice mythic there. I wonder if you can get these in foil. I haven't gotten any of these foil this card has been selling like crazy i'm sold out probably sold 30 copies of this card all the etched versions all the normal versions it's the hottest card for sure and a shattered one and a wow luxury suite beautiful extended foil luxury suite this card Beautiful. Wow. Really nice, really well centered. Foiling on this is really cool. This card is beautiful. Definitely not selling it right now. That's one we'll hang on to. I think all the lands in this land cycle are going up. They're as cheap as they're ever going to be right now. 
but it just takes time. You just gotta wait. You just gotta wait for these things to go out of print, for the land cycle not to be reprinted for a couple, couple years, and then these things are gonna be worth quite a bit more. Wayfarer's Bobble, nice common there. Dawn Gate. Got the planes. Come on, dragon. Let's go. Green Slime. Acrobatics. The Duke. Ancient Brass Dragon. Borderless, non-foil, but look at this card, man. And this is like a $25 card. Uh, this box is really, really good. Really, really good box. Boom. Here we go. I was feeling a borderless foil, but I mean, this box is so good. I don't even mind if we don't get one. Got the borderless non-foil. Got a Seagate. Beautiful foil Seagate. Come on. Two packs left. Let's do it. From the Catacombs. Eldritch Pact. Volo. A nice little etched mythic there. The Baba. And Call to the Void. All right. Two more packs. Let's go. Wow. Lightning bolt. Nice, beautiful. I love this lightning bolt. Really nice lightning bolt. Put that right there. Mirror of life trapping. Endless evil. Survivors. The council. Gale, ooh, this is a card that's been selling like crazy. Got the showcase foil, champion. All right, last pack, come on. Ancient Copper, one time. One time, in the close. Deadly Dispute foil, really nice common here. Thrakus, the Butcher. A nice Monster's Manual foil. Deadly, or Delayed fi uh, Blast Fireball. Blade of Selves. In the showcase. All right, we got a double dragon box. Can't tell me these aren't good boxes. Vexing puzzle box in the close. Beautiful. All right, we're going to tally these up real quick and, uh, See how much the entire box is worth. 